Welcome Asgardians to Bay's Fam Toy Reviews. Today we are looking at our collection of Thor hammers. So as you can see we have four awesome hammers. Uh, the first one that we got was this nice little foam. As you can see it has had much use slaying all kinds of ice giants and other enemies of Thor. It has lasted quite a while through all the battles that our son has had. It is very light. It's nice to kind of hit things, not people. Stay away from that. You don't want to hit your friends. We have had this for about three years. Uh, we got this at Target. It was a nice, inexpensive toy. The next one that we got is a kind of kind of a random one that we found on eBay. Uh, it is battery powered, which it takes a very odd shaped battery. The one thing that I do love about this one is that it does have the wrist strap, which none of the others do. Uh, so that kind of, you know, just gives it a little more authenticity. It does make noise. Uh, by pushing this little button right there. But the sounds are kind of different. Um, not. So, yeah, I'm not entirely sure where these sounds came from. And on one side you have the colored side and on the back, uh, when you push the button, it does light up. So that's kind of a nice little feature. But like I said, the sounds, not entirely sure where those sounds came from. The next hammer that we have is a Nerf hammer. This is probably my favorite one that we have. So um, as you can see, it looks just like Thor's hammer. It does have some weight to it, so if you actually start swinging it, it might hurt if you accidentally hit a friend. Um, on the top, we have a dart that is loaded and ready to go. And all you do to shoot the dart is pull that. And then this is, this is one of the reasons why this is my favorite, is that in order to shoot the dart, you can't just point and push the button. You actually have to swing. So here we go. So accuracy is not always the best. That was definitely not where I was aiming it, but it went in the general direction I was going for. So that might help. Uh, the bottom of it does hold two darts, so you can load another one, get it ready, and by the power of Thor. And finally, no Thor hammer collection would be complete without Stormbreaker. This is just a smaller version. So you do have kind of a uh, latex rubber side here, right? Um, on the end, as you just heard, it does make noise. Uh, the ax blade is foam, so safe, uh, but the part the hammer part right here is a plastic. So, you know, you still need to be kind of careful. As you can see, there is a tiny little Groot leaf that when pressed won't make noises. So this is another really cool one uh, that we have. Uh, and you can even see in the runes, um, if you're capable of reading that, uh, it does say Stormbreaker. But yeah, these are the Thor hammers that we have collected over the years that our son absolutely loves playing with. Usually when he wants to play with one of these, he goes and gets his Thor costume and puts that on and then runs around the house saving the world from, from Thanos. Well, if you want to see more of our toy videos or see more of our collection of stuff, <laughs> 
Make sure you subscribe, click that like button, and we'll see you next time.